Hi everyone! In this Premiere Pro tutorial, I will demonstrate how to make an auto-resizing text box without the need for third-party plugins or After Effects. This will all be done in a single text layer, so let's get started. Alright, now we are inside Premiere Pro. I have already created a 1920 by 1080 p sequence. First of all, let's select the Type tool, and then click somewhere on the Program Monitor and type anything that you want. After that, we can switch over to the Selection tool by clicking this icon. Now, we can move over to the Essential Graphics panel to change some settings of the text. To access the Essential Graphics panel, you need to go to the Window panel and then click on Essential Graphics. Now, let's change the font stuff. But of course, you can use any font that you like. Next, I am going to make the font size around 150. In the next step, we have to change the text color, and we need to add a rectangle background for the text. Before we change the fill color of the text, let's add the background first. So, click on this box to enable the background. Firstly, let's make the opacity of the background around 100%. Now, you can see a solid background under the text. Next, we have to make the size of the background around 40. After that, we have to change the color of the background, and then click on OK. Now, you can see on the program monitor, a rectangle background has been added. In the next step, let's change the fill color of the text. Now, we have to select the center alignment icon to align the text horizontally and vertically to the center of the screen. As you can see, the text is in the center position of the screen. In the next step, we need to round the corners of the rectangle background slightly. I am going to use an effect to round the corners of the rectangle background. This is a rough and edges effect. The Rough and Edges effect in Premiere Pro is a versatile tool that allows you to add an organic look to the edges of the object. Let's drag and drop the Rough and Edges effect onto the text layer. Let's move over to the Effect Controls panel to customize the Rough and Edges effect. First of all, we have to make the border value around 25. Next, we have to make the Edge Sharpness value around 5. Edge Sharpness controls how defined the edges will be. After that, let's make the Fractal Influence parameter value around 0. Fractal Influence determines the level of randomness in the edge texture. Now you can see on the program monitor, the corners of the background are rounded. In the next step, let's make the Scale parameter value around 209. And then, we have to make the X Offset parameter value around negative 26. And lastly, we have to make the Complexity parameter value around 1. By following these steps and experimenting with the settings, you can effectively use the Rough and Edges effect to round the corners of the rectangle background. Alright, as you can see, the Auto Resize text box is ready. Now, I am going to use a pop-up animation effect to animate the text box. This is an optional step. You can animate your text box in a different way. Alright, let's see how it looks now. It looks great. By the way, now you can change the text. The background of the text will automatically resize. As you can see on the program monitor, it looks great. In this way, you can create an auto-resize text box in just a few simple steps inside Premiere Pro. 